guys, it is Mary. And, and we want you guys to like, subscribe, share, and comment down below because today we are going to be reviewing season three, episode nine yes. of Sister Wives. We are three more episodes in that we are done with season three. We are doing this marathon. Yes, y'all. Y'all better hop out this. Y'all better subscribe and share yes. with everybody who yes, likes Sister yes, Wives. Yes. Okay? We post every single day, at least nine. So, or at least there. Somewhere. Episode nine. They yes. are going to, the family is finally going to Boston. Yes. And they decide to take their four oldest children, which is Madison, Janelle's daughter, she's mm -hmm. 15, um, um, Mariah, Mary's daughter, who's 16, and Aspen, Christine's daughter, who's 16, and then also Logan, Janelle's daughter, um, son, who is 17. Yeah. So they decide to take them with them so that they can at least look at the colleges and stuff. So they, you know, like Cody said, they don't have to just go to some Utah college. Hey, Cody, Utah colleges are good too, all right? <laughs> Not because, you know, you all have to run away. <laughs> I think now he's like, Utah, he's done with Utah, which I understand. Oh, Cody. my goodness, though. But there was actually a girl in the comment section. I saw her yesterday. I saw your comment, girl. I'm going to respond. Okay. Um, But she actually said, now, this is uh, allegedly. We allegedly, just say okay. Here. Um, she said that them running away to Utah was actually unnecessary. Them running away from Utah was unnecessary. Okay. Because they had, because the police or somebody had already done. Female. Um, a document, a documentary on them, okay. and they said that if they weren't abusing their children or doing anything blasphemous or whatever, that they would not persecute them. Oh, okay. So she actually said that them running away was unnecessary. It was for the drama. Oh, okay. Well, so y'all let us know what y'all think about that. I, I thought mean, that I was think, very interesting. Yeah, but I, I, I don't think uh, you move a family of twenty-one. I'm not saying that it's not true what she's saying, but I think maybe in their own minds. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You could see the terror in them, the uncertainty. And I think that in their own minds, you know, they didn't want to take a chance. Mm -hmm. They didn't want to, especially when, you know, they have had family members being arrested, families broken up. So they just didn't want to take a chance. You know, okay. some people are, are afraid of the government. There are some people who are. Right, who so. do not, like, take, oh, they said that. They're not going to prosecute and blase, blase. But who wants someone to be coming to do regular investigation in my family to ensure that I'm not abusing my kids on a regular basis? It would drive me crazy. Yeah. So, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, I can see where they just said, you know, something we're going. So, yeah. But we, we hear you, though. And thank you for the information. But I can see why they still, even if they knew that, why they still will, will go. You know, just seeing from their side. But anywho, so they went over to um, Boston, and Logan seems to like Danielle, the professor of theology. And she said, she is smart. She reminds me of Christine. Um, and because she's bubbly like Christine, I'm thinking Logan has a crush not only on Danielle, but probably on Christine when he first met her. Yeah. Yeah. But, and she um, said she's like, y'all, she's like, um, Harvard or Yale smart. So yeah. it's just so nice or whatever. I was like, okay. I and he did chop his hair off, which, you I know, know, at first. Looked different. Look, well, looked all like mature. I know, but I just, his hair looks a little greasy. Oh, okay. I think, you know, maybe, anyway. Yeah. I don't have that type of hair. Maybe yeah. just dry it out or something like that. Yeah. It looks a little oily, though. Oh, okay. I think he's getting used to it. Uh, but, yeah. Yeah. Maybe he didn't wash it that day, that morning. Anywho. But, um, yeah, so they did go to the school, and they asked them questions. But some of the students, they took the children out, and they were asking them, do you want to be in a polygamous family? Of course, Mariah said yes. Um, what's Paul her and her name? mama. Yeah, Mariah said yes. Um, Aspen said... We didn't even talk about how much Mary she, said she didn't want to be in a polygamous household in that other episode. Oh, like if she didn't... Oh, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Mary had made a comment that... In episode if 8. If people ask her all the time, I mean, if she cooled, will she do this? And, and she, she said, said, if I didn't need to do this, I will not do this. She did say that. That was telling. quite a very telling statement. <laughs> um, so if she didn't have to do this for her religion, she will not do this. That's what she said. But hey, Mariah said, I love, when she was talking to the college students, she said, I love this lifestyle. I can't wait to have sister wives. So she's all excited. Aspen was like, I'm not thinking about that. I am only 16. I don't think it'll be something for me at all. And that's what, that's Christine's daughter. Um, Madison, Janelle's daughter was like, it's a no for me. 
it's a definite no for me. <laughs> Logan, <laughs> and I don't even want a big family either. Yeah. So Logan, I'm sure she doesn't feel, you know. Yeah, Logan, he, um, I think he probably will buy the only Right there but, with his daddy. Yeah, but Logan, he's he right now he's focused on getting into a good school. I really like this for the children because they are like, those college kids seem so smart and put together. So it kind of like inspired them to go back to school, make sure they continue to get good grades yeah. and do even better. So that was nice. But um, Logan said he did very well on his SAT and ACTs, which are the tests that you take in getting into college. And he said he did very well. But even if he got into Harvard or Yale, he wouldn't go there. He said because it's just too far from home. And it's Aww. expensive. So he has decided to stay in Utah or in Las Vegas if it's going to be cheaper. You know, maybe stay in Las Vegas for a year. And he said, and then um, Aspen said, well, um, I think it was Aspen, yeah. So she said, well, um, he said, we can go to Las Vegas. And then in a year, no, him and Madison, a year or two, he will go to Utah with her or something like that, he said. I thought that was funny. Yeah. That was cute. No, he will go to Tuft. Tufts University. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, on the eastern coast, yeah. Um, but they'll be near home first. But yeah, I thought that was really nice. But they had the conference. What do you think about the conference? I thought it was um interesting. I'm glad that they, they had they asked them just, you know, questions that they were curious about and everything. And this is the professor of students, I am assuming. Yeah, yeah. Who, yeah, of her class, yeah. Well Robin decides to have a little show with her big tears. I don't yeah. think he deserves to run in hell. Talk about Warren Jones. I really do. Yeah. With no tears, I know. My she God. kills me with these no tears. <laughs> she kills me. I really do. Uh, I guess these days you don't have to show tears. You just have to make your voice and scrunch your face. <gasps> it's too do much. I look like crying yet? <laughs> do I need to put some water in my face? Uh, <laughs> no, you don't even have to do that. It's dry tears. That's what it is. Just rub it's your eyes and make crying. them red. Yeah. As you can I tell, just woke we up so are I can... not like you, Robbie, very much. Mm. But we're going to try to be non-biased. Civilized. <laughs> Above all else. We, we must, must be, be civilized. <laughs> Anywho, but, um, yeah, so they asked a really, you know, interesting questions. There was no vulgar stuff like, how are you all having sex? How does that go along? <laughs> do you have sex here with you? And do you... You know, none of those. What I like about them, questions. why I do like and about I this is that they don't. That, yeah, but, but I, but you know, I also did not expect that from college kids. No. Or just kids in general. Usually, the young people will not do that. Usually, it's adults. Usually, the adults who do that. Nonsense. Their head is in the gutter. In the gutter. In the gutter. Okay. Anywho, <laughs> that was all. It it was eye opening. I am. I'm actually proud of them because they are they were they are really opening up their family yeah and allowing people to look at them as just another family yeah and allowing other people who are polygamous to come out of the shadows mm. you know what i'm saying and live yes. their life you know live your life so, boo. um i can say in that sense cody you did good and, and the then you failed who allowed you to do that in the children but that was it for yes. um season episode nine of season three we might have to like subscribe share and comment down below